All right, good early afternoon, everybody. It's 1026 November 2nd. God bless each and every one of you. In the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. All right, you guys. Um, I'm going to be heading out to do a video. I'm just going to do a little quick upload here. Sharing on a dream I had last night. And uh, <coughs> I've heard a couple other people's dreams, too. Which, the number nine. Um... Uh, over a year ago, before I left where Cynthia used to live out there on the other island, um, I had a dream about hearing, and I heard about, well, what, what, what was happening, we were following somebody up a road, but it was like almost so straight up, it felt like the car could literally fall backwards, because we were climbing such a straight climb, the next thing I knew, we were in a room, and then this other person came up to me and they said, they know where they're at. Um, and uh, do you and and I said uh, I didn't know I didn't I mean I was in a dream I didn't even understand what was going on and they said you're nine miles from hell nine miles so I heard that number nine and uh, well now I'm hearing people that's having dreams somebody said they pulled up to a taco stand and they ordered a number nine and uh, a taco. And now the other day I had a dream about uh, tacos. And this is what's making me think of, uh, I had a dream the other day about the real cold weather where I seen ice on the interstate and the ice was like thick, real thick ice. And uh, there was no traffic on it. Nobody was driving at all. And it was very, I could see for a long ways, and there was no traffic on it. So that could mean that all the interstates going through America from this cold with this thick ice could shut down the interstates. But then I seen another interstate veering off one way, and there was people on it. I seen like people walking on it. And then I was like in a room, and there was a bunch of Spanish people. Mexican people that were there and they were like um, looking for food and stuff it could very well be like a caravan people looking to flee from this country if if what's gonna come is what I'm thinking is you know this nation is gonna it's gonna crash um, another lady had a dream where well anyhow it was so cold that I guess a helicopter crashed and they were laughing about it. Some of them were laughing about this. And uh, then there was another lady that had a dream and she said something about um, a bank. She seen a bank, it was real tiny, a small bank. And she gave this child some money to put into the bank, but they had to take scissors and cut the money up into small pieces. Yeah, you know, and then she said she had a dream about seeing like a like a fiesta party dress, you know, like maybe even like Spanish people would wear. And that's what I got out of it. And she said she seen the white dresses and then some other different types of dresses. There was like three closets. Three different types of doors to probably choose from. And uh Yeah, and then the dream that I had last night. Yeah, well, in that dream that I had where I seen the frozen highway, well, it was like I was in my cabin, and all of a sudden I seen a blanket come down in front of, right in front of me, just a solid blanket came down, and then I seen ice, you know, all on front of it, like it was just frozen, solid. You guys, I believe... 2020, an eye doctor would call 2020 his perfect vision. And then you know God is the creator of everything there is. And we are in bodies which are just vessels. And according to God's word, they're either a vessel of honor or a vessel of dishonor. So everybody has to look at um, um, God creates everything. Eye doctors, when they came up saying 2020 is perfect vision, that was a long time ago, okay? Now here we are coming up on 2020, 
I had a dream where I seen um, a blood red bolt and it had a, like a bank bolt door on it, like a bank bolt. And, tr and I heard a lady say he was only three, only three. And this was a military funeral, like a high ranking military funeral. And I've had other dreams too about Trump jumping out of a tall building with his wife on a parachute. And I jumped on top of that parachute. When we landed in the water, they went underwater. He was wearing a hazmat suit, like hazmat, you know, for like nuclear or who knows, to keep protected, protect them from. And then when they dove under the water, I was on top of the water and there was dead sheep all in the water. Dead sheep. You guys, we're probably getting close to um, things getting ready to start. And listen, trust in the Lord, God is our Lord and our Savior. And uh, Trump's getting ready to go on his three years. And in that dream, when I seen that blood red bolt, I heard a woman say he was only three. He was only three. Well, 2020, the house is divided. I heard Congress say a house divided. And we know in scripture it says a house divided won't stand, you know? These things are getting ready to probably start happening, you guys. I'm saying there's a very good chance it's getting ready to happen. Most people won't be ready for this, okay? Because they, they weren't able to receive our message, didn't take us seriously, I don't know. But uh, let us be ready, you know? The Lord let us out here a while ago to be, to be prepared. And here we are, winter's coming up, you guys. I had that dream last night where I seen two little, so we got two little cabins. It was in a big house, God's house, okay? God's the covering. You want to be on that rock. But that's what I seen was two little houses. One of them was full of like fall leaves, it was filled with leaves inside of it. And then I looked around again and all those leaves were gone, okay? God bless you guys. I love you all. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I'll be doing an upload here in a little while.